uh, well, on behalf of the show committee, I'd like to uh, welcome you all and thank you for coming. Um, it's been months we've been planning for today and this weekend, and I can't believe we've come almost to the end of it. And for us who are gardeners, it's been a pretty tough year. We had the awful wet spring and then drought and water restrictions, which were the bane of our lives. But shows the tenacity of, uh, I think as Michal O'Kaneda called us last year, the Kilinickers, uh, that we had such wonderful uh, exhibits this year, uh, over 300. So we're delighted with that. Um, I'd like now to, as we've come to the prize giving, hand over to our president, Mrs. Rose Hurley, and she'll have a few words for you. Thank you, Trace. Good afternoon, everyone. You're all very welcome and I hope you're having an enjoyable time here today. As president this year, I'm delighted to be here to preside over the show and to announce the prize winners. So, this year, when it was first, when we first thought about the show, and it was such a dry summer, we thought, will we have anyone on the show at all? And then we thought, well, if we do have exhibits, will they be of show standard? But we need to have bother because as you can see, uh, it's very successful. And thank you all very much for exhibiting. Again, thank you all for whatever input you had and for and are having here today. Your contribution is much appreciated. And now I'll hand you over to Teresa to present the prizes. I think that's what you've all been waiting for. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, Rose. Now, uh, we'll start with the uh, handing out of the uh, trophies. Um, the Jim and Rose Harley trophy for the best exhibit in the children's section goes to Claire Murphy. Do we have Claire Murphy? Well done, Claire. Well done. Now look at the camera. Look at the camera. Petrina Garden Centre Perpetual Shield for the best exhibit by school or community goes to the sunny days after school in Pierce's Town. Do we have representatives, please? Well done, Debbie. And well done, Debbie. Next, we have the Bally Kelly Garden Centre Trophy for the best exhibit of flowers. And this was won by Michael Fenlon. Do we have Michael Fenlon? Well done, Michael. Well done. The Murphy Super Value Rossner Harbour Trophy for the best family harvest exhibit. This was won by a couple, Mary Ford and Kevin Guth. Whoa, Mary and Kevin. And now we have the Salties Fish Trophy for the best exhibit of herbs. This was won by Anne Jordan. Do we have Anne Jordan? Well done. Now we have the Joyce's Expert Electrical Trophy for the best exhibit of herbal drinks. And this was won by Kathleen Talbot. <laughs> well done. And now we have the Maguire's Hardware Trophy for the best novelty exhibit. And this was won by Anne Jordan. Right. Collecting it for your mother. Okay, well done. Next we have the EPA Cup for the best exhibit of preserves. And this was won by Kelly Prendergast. Kelly? Well done, Kelly. Okay. 
Now we have the Tommy Kaffner Memorial Cup for the best exhibit of fruit. And this was won by Rose Hurley. Oh. <laughs> Now we have the Greenfields Farm Trophy for the best exhibit of vegetables. And this was won by Dylan Ryan. Dylan? Well done, Dylan. Your tomatoes. Good. <laughs> now we have the Wallace's Garden Centre Cup for the best pot plant. And this was won by Anne Johnson. Anne Johnson. Well done, Anne. Thank you. And now we have the Goths Central Bridgetown Trophy for the best exhibit of floral art. And this was won by Paula Hoare. Well done, Paula. Well done. Now, the Mount Eaton Stud Award for Young Gardener of the Year, 2018. And this was won by Harvey O'Brien. Harvey, well done. Now we come to special awards for all the children's exhibits. And these are sponsored by McDonald's and Playzone. And they go to the following children who have exhibited individually. So could we have Mia Ryan and Leo Ryan? Good. Could we have Harvey O'Brien? Well done, Harvey. Uh, could we have Lucas and Elijah Page Redmond? Lucas and Elijah. Could we have Michael Murphy and Claire Murphy? That's lovely. Look at the camera. Who's coming forward for the uh, Sunny Days, Kilmore and Pierce's Town? Debbie. I've a helper. And you've got a helper with you. Kilmore's not here. Alright, you'll take Okay, next. Um, the Murphy's Daybreak Kilmore Trophy for the most points in show. And this was won by Paula Hoare. Paula, well done. Well done, Paula. Okay, the Cockley Walled Garden Cup for the overall best exhibit in the show. And this was won by Mary Ford and Kevin Gough. And now, this is the last one. The Sophie Mar Trophy to the runner-up for the best exhibit in the show. And this was won by Dylan Ryan. That is the list of trophy winners, award winners. And well done to all of them. Right, folks, thank you very much for your attention and for all your hard work and to visitors for coming and we hope we see you next year at the ninth annual gardening show. So thank you. Bye-bye. Hello there. You can hear me now. Thank you very much. Um, please start to remove your exhibits very slowly, very carefully and only take what you brought to the show but please take it all back home again. There's no hurry because we can get out of the gates any time between now and Saturday. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Cheers, my dears.